Hi, we are at the farmhouse and Sam seems to be very busy. Hey Sam, what's up? A local bakery is attempting to make the largest cake in town and Sam has to pack and send 420 eggs to the bakery right away. How many eggs have you collected so far, Sam? Sam has 14 trays of 24 eggs each. How many eggs does he have in all? What do you think you need to do to find the answer? Multiplication, of course. Number of eggs in each tray is equal to 24. Number of trays is equal to 14. So, the total number of eggs is equal to 24 multiplied by 14. We always start multiplying by the digit at the 1's place. Multiplying 24 by 4, we get 96. Before multiplying 24 by 1 at the 10's place, we put a 0 at the 1's place in the answer. Multiplying 24 by 1, we get 24 itself. Adding 96 and 240, we get 336. So, Sam has 336 eggs in all. Sam has 336 eggs. How many more eggs does he need to have 420 eggs? What do you think you need to do to find the answer? Subtraction is correct. The total number of required eggs is equal to 420. Number of eggs collected is equal to 336. So, the number of more eggs required is equal to 420 minus 336. We always start subtraction from the digit in the 1's column. Since 0 is less than 6, we borrow 1 from the tens column. Subtracting 6 from 10 in the ones column, we get 4 as the answer. Now, 1 is less than 3 in the tens column. So, we borrow 1 from the hundreds column. Subtracting 3 from 11 in the tens column, we get 8 as the answer. Subtracting 3 from 3 in the hundreds column, we get 0 as the answer. So, 84 more eggs are required by Sam to make 420 eggs. Sam had 336 eggs. He collected 96 more eggs. What is the total number of eggs collected? What do you think you need to do to find the answer? This calls for addition. Number of eggs Sam already had is equal to 336. Number of more eggs Sam collected is equal to 96. So, the total number of eggs is equal to 336 plus 96. We always start adding from the digit in the 1's column. Thus, adding 6 and 6 in the 1's column, we get 12. So, we write 2 in the answer and carry over 1 to the 10's column. Adding the carry over 1 to 3 and 9 in the 10's column, we get 13. So, we write 3 in the answer and carry over 1 to the hundreds column. Adding the carry over 1 to 3 in the hundreds column, we get 4. So, the total number of eggs collected is 432. Since some eggs might break in transportation, 
Sam has decided to send all 432 eggs in place of 420 eggs. Sam has packed 432 eggs equally in 6 cartons. How many eggs are there in each carton? What do you think you need to do to find the answer? If you said division, you are absolutely correct. Total number of eggs is equal to 432. Number of cartons is equal to 6. So, the number of eggs in each carton is equal to 432 divided by 6. 4 is less than 6. So, we cannot divide 4 by 6. So, we consider 43. 6 sevenths are 42 and 6 eighths are 48. So, 6 goes 7 times in 42. We write 7 in the quotient and 42 below 43. Subtracting 42 from 43, we get 1. Next, we bring down 2 from the dividend. 6 goes 2 times in 12. We write 2 in the quotient and 12 below 12. Subtracting 12 from 12, we get 0. Since there are no more digits in the dividend, the division is over. The quotient is 72. So, there are 72 eggs in each carton. Thanks for helping Sam complete his job. See you soon!